Hey guys, it's Dr. Sean over at The Natural Body Works, and you know, I just finished doing five sessions of this uh, TDC, uh, TCDS, uh, Trans uh, Cranial Direct Current Stimulator, and uh, so th this here, here we've got uh, the the cathode over here, the positive end over here, and we've got the anode on this side, and this is both um, you know, hit down by the the strap here that you that you get with it. Um, this is on the the prefrontal cortex, the, the dorso you know, on the top, like lateral uh, prefrontal uh, in the front here, in front of the the sutures in this area. Uh, frontal cortex, uh, frontal cortex in the, in the frontal lobe of the brain is what you do for. Um, uh, planning and higher thinking and so uh, like they call it like the advanced the human brain right um, although you do see the same lobes in sheep and you see them in cows and you see them in pigs and you see them in all these guys and dogs and cats and everything like that however we just don't think that they're as advanced as ours but um, you know we're starting to prove that otherwise but anyway so here's a couple things that I noticed in doing this for five times the one of the main things I was doing five sessions over five days and what I did is I, I ended up doing about 25 minutes uh, on each setting and I was doing them at night before I go to bed and one of the things I noticed is that in 25 minutes I really did relax um, this side the the cathode okay these have to have some saline I made some saline water which you can see in the other video and I'll put that right up uh, right up there and you can see the um, uh, the, the saline you, you pour it on these and you keep them nice and moist now when these things dry out they get a little crusty because there's a lot of salt in here right this is saline solution that we made and um, the the formula is in the the last video I'll give that to you uh, maybe in the little crawl down here or something like that but these things get pretty crusty so you got to kind of clean them off and rinse them a little bit um, uh, it's it's a good little machine um, I was not uh, completely impressed although here's what I noticed happened to me number one in 25 minutes of sitting there I did relax now I'd done meditation for more than well 25 years and so just going into that meditative uh, kind of feel that meditative kind of zone was pretty easy for me and it was easy to sit here and not do anything else so I didn't do anything like read or 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 play video games or or watch TV or anything like that I could have and I and probably should just kind of see if there's a difference now I did sleep like a dead guy which is a really good thing I did sleep better and I had more vivid dreams when I was using this than since now it's been about um, uh, like it was a uh, about a week before after I did the last video that I even started so I didn't notice any vi any any dreams or anything like that there was nothing interesting um, I was feeling a little bit low but that was because of I think uh, the normal tension of the times we've got this uh, um, pandemic thing going on and you've got you know, like people are sequestering themselves and people can't see each other's faces they're all wearing masks and all these kind of things so I decided I'm gonna do this and see if I see any difference now I was waking up a little bit earlier I did notice that as well so number one I was getting relaxed for sure number two better sleep and better dreams that was pretty interesting now knowing that this in no way in 18 volts and 2 milliamps is going through my skin through the three layers of skin through the fascia through the periosteum through the bone itself through the marrow through the endosteum and through the the cerebral spinal fluid into the what we have the dura matter the the pia matter and the, uh, the arachnoid matter and the pia matter all that stuff to the brain there's no way it was getting in there so what was actually going on I think what we were getting is um, well one a darn good rest okay the 25 minutes forced me to sit and do nothing but think about what this thing was doing now that's an important point though we, we have to realize that sometimes like in acupuncture and in some other uh, in Reiki and other other forms of healing which are considered pretty esoteric the concentration and the the ability for you to get the the consciousness to the area of problem will help you more now this thing here this machine this is the apex 
There it is right here, there we go, the Apex. Um, this, when we have it all set up, it goes to two, only two, two milliamps. The um, scale here goes to five, but I guess maybe if we just souped it up and put more batteries or something, I don't know. There is a, there is a version I've noticed that uh, from the company that has four milliamps, but we don't use that, we only need two, because that's what most of the, the documentation and most of the research, the research that we found um, does is, is kind of gets you this two milliamp sessions. So that was just one set that I did. Now I should probably do more and it'll give me a chance to wait another week or two and do another set of five just to see if there's, if I, if I relapse kind of thing. Now I'm not going to say that I'm actually depressed. I'm not depressed. I've never really been depressed. Of course I have depressed moments and I have depressed feelings and all that kind of stuff. And, and my affect does go down. It's, it's a typical thing. That's part of the human condition. But one, because of my meditation practice, I've learned to realize that and see it for what it is and understand that it's a process of my brain and I can actually make things change through my own actions and thoughts. Um, so doing this, I wrote down notes too. So let me see what I wrote down for my notes. The first time I did this, um, my energy scale, I would put it on a scale of one to five, five being like, wow, my energy is really crazy. And one is I'm really depressed and, and ready to sleep. Uh, that first day I was about three on the scale of five, two milliamps, 25 minutes saline, um, on the pads, of course, start symptoms were a little bit of melancholy. I did have stuffy nose, especially on the left, intestinal gas fatigue. Um, uh, last, I didn't sleep well the night before the first one. Okay, I had a really terrible night's sleep, and it doesn't say why. I think I was just upset or something like that, or I just, I think I, what I did is stay up and watch TV, which I should have done. Um, there was some stinging on the right side, mild throbbing in head, possibly due to the head. Uh, the headband, okay, after about 10 minutes, um, tight feel, um, uh, more like just a tight feel on the head, sleepy afterwards, um, I don't know, the, the, the last few minutes went really slow, and I think that's because I was watching the clock, which is to try not to do that, set a timer and don't even look at the timer, that'd be a good thing to do, about 20, 25 minutes in there, to maybe 30 minutes, but uh, uh, I did 25 just to kind of like split the difference. Um, I liked the machine as I went on the day two, um, good, better, better mood, you know, mild stuffy nose day three, uh, my stuffy nose was gone, but I don't think that had anything to do with this. Um, I was starting to do some neti pot stuff and, um, uh, drink more water and we, 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 hadn't yet had the fires where we have. So there wasn't a lot of like particulate matter in the air, but there was a lot of sinus problems that people had and some, some, uh, um, allergies, although I don't really have those, but sometimes I'll use a spray or like I said, a neti pot. So, um, uh, I'm going to give this thing a thumbs up at least for checking on. Now, later on, there's a couple other points I want to do, and I'm going to do another session before I redo the depression one. I'm going to do one for, uh, the, the points are back here on this, on the back of the head and side, and that's going to be for, um, really intuition and kind of uh, imagination. And we're gonna see what shows up with that. Now, if that does anything for my dream state, I'll be really impressed. And so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I think it's also a five day, but I'll get back and I'll start it with another video so you can watch that one um, and do that. So if you get one of these or you get something like it, um, I like it that it's, I like this one because I can move these around A for comfort and B for just better contact. Um, it's got a good little, you know, little sweatband headband thing here, which I think is pretty schnazzy and handy. Um, this is a very simple machine. It's a very easy to run machine and it doesn't really, uh, um, there's nothing really, you know, too intense about this one. I think it's a great little, this guy's a great little machine. I mean, just, why not? I mean, it did cost a little bit though. It was a couple hundred bucks. So if you've tried this, the transcranial direct current stimulation, or you'd want to try it, what would you try it for? What did you try it for? And how did you get? So put that in the comments down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe because I'm going to be doing more on this thing. And I have a couple other ones too. And I've done some stuff on uh, the Gansfeld effect. And I've, I've played with that myself. I've done some other uh, biofeedback things. There's some visual biofeedback things and with, with sound and with binaural beats and stuff like that. And I'm going to go through and do some of those. Um, one, because it's fun and I'm really interested in altered states 
states of consciousness. I have done in the past a lot of um, uh, sensory deprivation tanks, but this was like in the late 80s, man, when it was still uh, kind of a creepy, wacky stuff. And, and a lot of the machines, like the the um, thought stream that I showed and some of the other machines with the goggles and stuff like that that I will show in, in different video actually haven't changed that much. I don't know why. You'd think they'd be a lot more, um, you know, bang for the buck with the uh, 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 getting them pretty hyped up and getting a, 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 an app with them or something like that, but I haven't really seen too much of that. So um, I have used things like uh, some EEG uh, like the Muse and some other things like that. I ended up sending them all back because I didn't like them. I didn't think they did anything. Or you had to have an Apple, and I have an Android. I didn't like that. I didn't want to have to buy an Apple computer, or Apple iPad, iPod, something like that, just to have this one machine, which still costs like 350 bucks. Um, to use. So anyway, this is Dr. Sean over the Natural Body Works. If you guys are interested in doing more with either depression, and I, I, I do a lot of stuff for this, so look up up here again, and there's actually that, that acupuncture pen, this thing here that I do a lot of stuff with. There's stuff on there for anger, frustration, worry, and depression. So check those out as well. Um, you guys take care of yourselves, and I will see you on the next one for some brain zapping. Okay? See ya.